presenting Pharmanex today. Uh, Pharmanex is an anti-aging company. It's a nutritional company. And uh, as far as uh, credibility is concerned, you know, I thought about this. Well, I could talk all day long about science and, and uh, say this was a $110 million patented product, but who but the best, Dr. Oz, as a credibility partner. So I'm going to show this to you first, and then we're going to have some questions and answers so I can kind of relate to you. And thank you for the opportunity to share this with you. This is a big passion. I was the manager at uh, the Roswell store for over 13 years. I was kind of like the medicine woman of uh, a Roswell. I always, you know, we, people would come to me with their babies or their grandfather or their mother, and I would help them with herbs and supplements. So getting into this marketplace is really new for me. And I thank you, Peter, for the opportunity. So without further ado, Dr. Oz for about six minutes. Yeah, sir. And your ability to fight it lies in one of the biggest buzzwords in health, antioxidants. Today, we're fighting the war on cancer with prevention, antioxidant prevention. And I'm sharing my cancer-fighting antioxidant all-stars, the three most important ones you need to help you prevent cancer. Do you have enough? That's why our audience is wearing these different colored t-shirts. You've seen them advertised everywhere. A glass of Welch's purple grape juice has twice the natural antioxidant level. This cacti cream is so rich in the absolute best antioxidants. A new sample antioxidant water. It helps protect your body. Antioxidants are found in many fruits and vegetables, and they might just be your body's ultimate secret weapons against cancer. But what exactly are antioxidants, and why are they so good for you? As I discovered, most of you don't even have a clue. What's an antioxidant? I don't know. Do you know any antioxidants? No, oh, no, it's a great tea. You know what an antioxidant is? An antioxidant? Yes. You know what has antioxidants in it? I don't want to say the wrong stuff. I'm with your daughter here. I got a question for both of you. Can you name an antioxidant? Pioneer, Dr. William Lee. Dr. Lee, thank you very much for joining us in the Talk about antioxidants and how they prevent cancer. Well, antioxidants are natural protective molecules that Mother Nature has laced into a large number of foods. And there are literally thousands of different types of antioxidants, but they all do pretty much the same thing. They protect our DNA in healthy cells from the type of damage caused by free radicals, which are harmful chemicals that our body absorbs from things like cigarette smoke or pollution or fried foods or other sources of the environment. So antioxidants protect our DNA against the kind of damage that can cause cancer. So you see why it's so important to both of us and all doctors are concerned about preventing cancer that you have enough. So everyone in our audience today is wearing their antioxidant health on their sleeve. All wear different color t-shirts. Before the show, we give everyone the ultimate nutritional lie detector test. This revolutionary device, it's lying right here next to me, measures the level of carotenoids in your skin, which can help indicate the overall antioxidant health in your body. It's a completely non-invasive test. Did it hurt you? Yeah? All right. Good, good. I haven't had mine yet. I'm having it next. So we can see if it hurts me. But it takes about 90 seconds, and I am sta completely astounded by these results. Let me come on over here. We're going to show it to everybody. So if you look at this, this is, this is how it's supposed to be read out, by the way. We've got lowest to highest. 10,000 up to 50,000 units, right? Or the, the, or the, these figures give us a rough idea. You want to be up here in the blues. Now, let's see how you did. Are you ready? I don't see any reds, any oranges. Let's see the numbers for the audience. You're all down here. Can I tell you something? You're America. You're a cross section. Everyone watching the show right now. Let me just go through these because it completely blew my mind. We have almost 40% of the audience in the lowest category possible. I actually didn't think we'd find anybody there. Not naively thought that at least we're getting enough of these antioxidants into our bodies that we wouldn't be there. Another 40% had the orange category, which is still, to me, a, a dangerously low level. And we only had a total of about 6% ha having greens and blues. Put your hands up here, greens and blues. You can just see it. Like, yeah, I mean, there are a couple folks. But, you know, it's not many. Congratulations, by the way. <laughs> so the question then becomes, you know, why is it they have these problems? And it's not surprising because we're getting on average about two to three servings of fruit per day and vegetables. It's not enough. 
And we know that. We, when we talk about five, seven, nine, big numbers of surveys, physical size. So, I haven't had a test yet. So before I give you a hard time, let's see how I'm doing. Uh, ready to go? Right. And that's the why I do this. Uh, talk to me about antioxidants. What foods have them? How can folks find them, even if they don't know the chemical names? Well, you can certainly get antioxidants in pill form. But the very best way of actually getting antioxidants is in the foods that we eat. And what about organic versus inorganic? I get asked that a lot from the audience. Does it make a big difference with regard to antioxidant power? Yeah, well, some studies have actually shown that foods grown organically can have greater levels of antioxidants. And the reason is because antioxidants also protect plants. When plants are grown organically, that's without pesticides or chemicals or antibiotics, they actually have to produce more antioxidants to protect themselves. Right. And when we eat them, we get the benefits too. Uh, that makes sense, everybody? All right, let's see how I'm doing here. Uh-oh. 75,000. Now, listen. We're offering more colors as we Pardon me? He's 75,000. It goes from, we have a scale from zero to over 100,000, and he's 75,000. What color? What color? It's blue. It's blue. It's blue. It's blue. No. It was blue. And we, we, have, we have these little cards here that, can, that show you exactly where you are. They're from you know, red and then maybe lower than 10,000 up to 100,000. So we were approached three times at the store about this machine. And we've taken several years talking about credibility. I've done different test groups. I've done the top people in this town as far as nutritional that own health food stores that have been in the health food store business, health business friends of Nathan's that have been in over 30 years. And you know, they think they're eating well. They say, well, what, you know, my greatest question is, I'm a healthy eater, well, what does that mean? Well, I have kale every day. You know, I have a salad every day. Well, it's not enough, guys. And a lot of you are, are into the insurance business, but this is prevention. We've got, I wanna, so I wish you could just like blow the top of your heads off and show you what an opportunity this could be to each one of you in a different way. It could be a personal situation. We could test heart disease. We could t test women every day. I mean, Lewis, you talk about fear and you talk about, you know, mm -hmm. we're gonna revolutionize this country and open people's mm -hmm. minds about healthcare, about taking, taking steps to maybe look at alternative ideas. Well, there's, there's one of these machines in the, um, uh, in the teachers in Georgia. Why are we not testing kids? I mean, seven to nine fruits and vegetables a day. That's what this machine is testing, okay? These are your antioxidants. These are your lycopene, lutein, astaxanthin, carotenoids, which is in a matrix they found out if those are high, then your A, C, and E is also high because those carotenoids are the bodyguards for the cell. And I have a little picture of a cell. So what I'd like to do today is, you know, we're going to stay after to test you. Or we have an event at my house on the 23rd on Saturday that I passed around. You're welcome to come to that and get tested if you're busy today. Or if you'd like to call and just like have a private consultation, I can come to you. It's portable. Um, in whatever way I can serve you. But, you know, Peter wanted to say, well, how, you know, how can I be of service to this community? I mean, what, is it, what would it mean to you to have more energy and to feel better? <laughs> awesome. Right. So what do you think, how many fruits and vegetables do you take in today in your daily diet? Well, it, it helps to take neutralite food supplements too. Okay, so, so that, that yeah. works for you. Yeah, along with the natural stuff. Okay. I take a fruits and vegetable supplement. Okay, so we're going to see today how well, you well, how well you score and how is it being absorbed. You know, we had a health food store with the top supplements in this country over 30 years of experience, Solar Ray. Nature's Plus, I mean, mega foods, I could go on and on. Whole food supplements, USP supplements, no, none of the multiples were, were measuring up. I'm not saying that, you know, they weren't providing B vitamins or some minerals, but anyways, I'm really passionate and I'm excited about it. What about you, what, what do you think about in heart disease? You know, antioxidants are really important in prevention of heart disease. How could this be used possibly in your arena for for women to getting a score for prevention before they're even sick. Excited about it. Does anybody have any questions? Yes. Okay. So you know that your score sucks, right? Right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so orange t shirt. Yeah. Right. yeah. Uh, if you're orange, what do you do? What do you do to prevent that? I 
None of us are going to get this seven to nine fruits and vegetables a day. I sure as heck am not. Well, that's I'm a good from Ohio. question. I eat meat and potatoes. Okay, that's a good question. You're right. And how long more? I mean, how many more years do you want to be in the work work field? Hundred. Okay, so we want another hundred years. Okay, well that's why we've got nanotechnology and these supplements. We do sell supplements. They were separate. These supplements were not created for the machine. The machine was originally created for optometrists, and then it was bought for 110 million dollars because optometrists can see behind the eye from. Uh, the, the supplement, the carotenoids for, to prevent macular degeneration, it was bought for $110 million. Pharmanex bought it, but they already had the life pack nano. But this is now proven to, to raise your, your score. Also, we have the juice, which is from um, Vietnam, which is called the Heaven, Heaven Juice. Yes, Peter? Two minutes left. Okay, yes. Uh, how much time does it take to, to do the test? Uh, 90 seconds. Good question. Can we do one now while you're talking during the two okay. minutes? No, there's not time right now. Volunteer? No, do it afterwards. Yeah, we'll we're, do it afterwards. We're running out of time. Yeah, yeah, two minutes, 90 seconds, no. just to see. Yeah. I've been taking those for six weeks. You can show how high mine has gone out. Right, but they don't know the per you know, There are 8,000 supplements out there. They, they all say, I have this study that proves mine is the best. It's all right. about absorption, right? So how, how do you know? Well, this is what, this is what we're saying is this is what measure, is going to measure it in relationship to your multiple. That's what I mean. You're going to get your antioxidant levels. Now, this is not measuring B vitamins or minerals. But this has, you know, I mean, triple blind studies. We don't not even really talk about the scientific studies, but this is proving, are your supplements measuring up? This is a measurement tool. This is a behavior modification tool. So when I, I can't lie. I can't say, oh, I've lost 30 pounds, but does this know? Because weight creates, unfortunately, there is no healthy overweight person. I'm so, sad to say that, but there isn't. It creates a toxic substance that, creates free radicals. So this creates free radicals. You've got to have a high antioxidants to beat that down. So um, I tested raw food groups. Then those are the people who, who only eat, I'm talking about raw food people who've eaten nothing but fruits and vegetables for eight years. A lot of them scored very high. Okay. So I've tested different marketplaces. Peter, did you have a question? Very good. Perfect. I want to impress you. Oh, only kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, without anything, anything else for anyone, anybody else? All right. Well, I guess we'll just wrap it up and get going. And thank you so much for letting yeah. me be of service. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye -bye. So